Salutations, everyone. My name is Gwen, and welcome to an Essentials Hobby Closet. So, once again, it's been a bit. I'm not going to go into my whole list of uh, excuses, because it's just too long, and no one has time for that. <laughs> uh, one of my, my resolutions, I don't really do New Year's resolutions, but one of my things I want to be better about this year is posting videos more consistently, let's say, and not have four to six month gaps between my videos. We're going to see how that goes though, because I have a lot of brain stuff that makes it difficult for me to work on things. Anyway, so this is a video that I had planned way back in October <laughs> for Halloween, uh, which was to redesign Strawberry Shortcake characters as witches. Uh, for those who do not know, Strawberry Shortcake uh, has been around since the 80s i believe uh i'll if i'm incorrect i'll put i'll put the actual date in the somewhere in the video <laughs> uh and they're just like these cute little uh little characters mostly girls sometimes boys named after a various uh fruits or uh desserts uh and they you know they go on little adventures and teach you know morals and f friendship and you know typical children's show stuff this was a show that I watched when I was a kid, in like the early 2000s. Uh, I had a couple of like the little dolls and things like that. And uh, I thought it'd be cool to like reimagine Strawberry Shortcake as like a cute little witch coven sort of thing. Uh, this is going to be a three part series. And I am not doing every single Strawberry Shortcake character that has ever existed because that's insane. If you go look on the Strawberry Shortcake wiki, you will see how many characters there are, and I'm just- I'm not- I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I'm still doing about 10 characters, though, so, uh, I- I- I'm- I'm not slacking. I promise. I'm not slacking. So this is the basic part that I don't always show in my previous videos, is that I do a very basic sort of concepting phase for a lot of my designs where I do like a basic body and I will put outfits and hair and stuff on it so that I can focus less on anatomy and posing and more on uh, silhouettes, uh, details, and color palettes. Um, I basically use the same body for most of the characters here. And there are times when I would work on uh, a character and then I would realize that I liked it better for like a different character so I'd switch it around. So, uh, for example, I had this idea for Ginger Snap, but then I decided that I would use it later on for Plum Pudding and then I did a different design. I end up later actually doing a completely different outfit design for Ginger Snap. Ginger Snap was just in general giving me a hard time. But yeah, this is not what Ginger Snap's outfit looks like. I really, I really enjoy this sort of phase in concepting. I, I, I don't know why, it's just a lot of fun. So I started off with Strawberry Shortcake, obviously. I really wanted to have like these really nice finished sort of illustrations, so I was trying really hard to have some different posing, like to have more energy and stuff. So I like the idea of Strawberry Shortcake sort of like reaching out to the viewer, because in the show that I watched, I don't know if that's in every iteration of the show, she would uh, like be talking to the viewers a lot. And I also like the idea of her, like, obviously having a witch's broom, but also having this cute little lantern, because she's, like, the leader of her friend group and stuff. So she's, like, a guiding light or whatever. And I took that opportunity to design the lantern to look like a cute little strawberry, and I, I love it. Uh, this hand, hands give me trouble. When, when the good lord decided to give us hands, he really, he really did not have the artists in mind. And I don't know how to feel about that. That is all. Uh, I finally reach a point that I'm like, yep, yeah, uh, it's, it's good enough. Uh, I still don't care for it, but at some point it's just, you, sometimes you just gotta take it at, at, that it is what it is. I might, I don't know, maybe I'll try again. I don't know. I mostly base the designs off of the show that I watched in the early 2000s with a little bit of the original character designs because I'm more familiar with the personalities of the characters in the early 2000s, however, I feel like the designs from 
the ori from the original uh, characters suits more of what I was going for. Uh, next, I did Orange Blossom, and uh, I don't know. I I just love her design a lot um, because she owns like a fruit, uh, like an like an orchard, uh, and is an artist and stuff. I gave her a cute little basket, and uh, you know, cute little little fluffy fluffy buns that uh, a lot of her designs depict her with. Uh, at some point, I guess they ironed out her hair, and she had straight hair for a long time, but uh, I. I like the fluffy buns. I think they're just stinking cute. So I did, I did that, and I based quite a bit of her design off of her original design, the uh, from the '80s. I don't know. I think it's cute. I like the flowers. I like the color palette. I like everything about this. Uh, you see me switch a lot in these between, like my illustration and the orig first strawberry shortcake drawing. And that's because I was trying to keep everything pretty um, consistent in art style because I wanted to be able to fit them all together later on. This is me working on my first draft of Ginger Snap. I actually didn't end up recording myself during the final draft because I was having such a hard time. I didn't like the pose. It felt very stiff. It didn't have a lot of personality like uh, Strawberry and, and uh, Orange Blossom had. Uh, so I redid it, but I didn't record myself because I wanted to give myself like a little bit of a break. Uh, focus on design and not worry about like people seeing. Uh, that was kind of probably a, a big L on my part, but you know, sometimes it, it is what it is, and I was doing my best. I made Ginger Snap look more like a mechanic because in the show she has like this factory with all these machines that she invented uh, to make cookies and stuff. So, like, you know, she's a magical witch, but she also, uh, you know, can work with machinery and stuff. And that's all for uh, this video. In the next video, I will be drawing angel cake, apple dumpling, and uh, huckleberry pie. Uh, in the comments below, tell me uh, if you have a favorite strawberry shortcake character. And if you don't, tell me what your favorite dessert is. I'm personally a big fan of angel food cake and uh, like coffee cakes uh, and just like fruit in general. <laughs> uh, especially like blueberries and strawberries and pineapple, things like that. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy, enjoyed this video, please uh, consider liking the video and subscribing. Uh, I do a lot of these uh, art videos with every intention of doing other things in the future, but I've been promising that for over a year now. So <laughs> thank you again for watching. And until next time, Please take care of yourselves and do the things that you love to do the most. Bye-bye!